Hello guys, after my successful campaign as France, where I take over Germany and Italy and Spain, I have decided to try something different. I'm going to be playing as... Oh, you already know, because you've seen the thumbnail on top. I'm going to play as Saudi Arabia. Again, it's not going to be a big deal, so it's not going for world conquest. Anymore. I'm just going to try and establish myself as a sort of power. Probably going to go fascist or some nonsense like that. I don't know, we'll find out. But I'm a mood, yes, let's go! Hey! Let's act over the top like other YouTubers do. They get views out of it. Right, so we start with a factory making basic infantry equipment insufficiently because we have no steel. We have... What do you mean we have no oil? we Saudi Arabia. We only have 42 people over there as well. You're telling me we only have 3 million people as well? What? And we can invade Yemen. Isn't that what Saudi Arabia usually tries to do? Invade Yemen. Alright, well, we're definitely going fascist then. That's just, uh, that's just... House of Sword. <laughs> Wait, what? If we're... Can we, how can we... Can we fabricate claims? Just by walls? We'd wall tension at least 50%. I don't want to wait that long. Who's leader of Democratic? Ford, Hassan, Umar. The House of Saud... You need to go, mate. Is he winking or is he just unable to keep his eyes open? Abdulaziz Ibn Sword. Yep. We're not going to be you, mate. We're going to be someone else. Okie doke. Oh, lovely. I like the uh, I like the normal focus tree. This, the one where there's nothing. I like that. So, here's our army. These, these fellas. That's that's it. Let's go on there, border. Don't have anything else to do. May as well do that. Okay then. See, Iraq's gonna be stronger than me. Whoa. That's a new portrait. All right. Yeah, they have more people. Damn Iraqis. Can't be having that. Oh, right, yes, I need to import some stuff, but I can't because I have no factories to import it with. Ooh, so I'm basically playing as Cornwall again. Who would have imagined? Right, free commander, Jamal Ibn Hassan. Alrighty. Alright. Have your little, your little goal if you want. You might win. You might do nothing. I don't know. Not really much going on down here in the desert. Oh, damn. I forgot to start research. Oh, well, I would prefer better guns at the very least. And how about some of these support weapon didgeridoos? We only have the one factory. There's not much else I can do about it. After I get on my way of turning fascist, I will start the other stuff. Guessing my factories, because I do need my factories. Quite badly, I need my factories, yes. See, the whole of India has two, <laughs> two factories, mate. What? What's going on over here? What? What? What are you doing? What's this map looking all weird for? Um, I don't know. The new patch came out early today. I played as France. It went very well. Go check it out. Check out that series if you haven't already. And uh, now we're just. I'm seeing a bug. I I think maybe that's from where they annexed the other dude. It just hasn't come out right because no 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 they all have. Militarization of the Rhineland, political effort, glorious. Now we will go down the effort of industrial effort. Lovely, very much. But we want a fascist demigo. Alian Ofman Noor. This will take a very long time to happen. But. Nonetheless, no, we are Saudi Arabia. We don't care about the younger generations. We're the higher-ups. 
We are a patriarchal country. The higher ups get to say, no one else does. So it's just how it is, mate. Now we don't even start with the right amount of guns. It's sad. Maybe if we actually started with the right amount of guns, we could like train or something, but no. What even are our divisions? Besides useless, I would like to know. So just wait, I need to win a war just to be able to use stuff correctly. That just is absurd. I wonder what the country even becomes called when you switch from Saudi Arabia. Oh, if you just heard that sound, that is the sound of my uh, video files duplicating on the French series. Spanish Civil War, good for your mates. So we don't even make one gun per day, because we lack the resources to do so. I'm never going to have natural resources either. Like, you don't have any. You have a little bit of oil. You have a little bit of oil. Iraq has a lot of oil. Ah, Iraq. Iran has a lot of oil as well. Yes, we want to control the oil. That's what we want. Yes. What do our men look like? Are they white? White sprite? Can't see. Facing the wrong way. The enemies the other they're behind you, mate. Never mind. Where does GB hold that? That's like Yemen stronghold. Why does GB have all this stuff? Give your men their land again. Little rhyme. That's cool. Right. Well, I guess there's not much else going to be happening. We just need to wait until we have factories and we can start to build guns with zero materials to even do it. I'm going to go down the uh, the other route, the uh, construction effort route, because I need that civilian slot to build a factory. It's just the way it is. Now, Abu Bakr ibn Umar is getting a lot of support very fast. I'm very happy for you, uh, Abu Bakr ibn Umar. Yes. Ah, support weapons. And then infantry equipment level 1. Which means we can actually build correct guns. Not rubbish guns, correct guns. Right. Now, with our correct guns, we are going to want support equipment to support the men. Oh, we already have great war tank. Oh, nice. Let's go for light tanks as well. Then we'll go for artillery, and eventually, we might have enough factories to actually build the stuff we need. Very good. Right. Now we just wait again because construction effort is required. Very, very glorious. House of Saud. JB, give someone this land back. So that is South Africa, but in modern days, isn't that Botswana? Where is Botswana? I like Botswana. I've been reading up on Botswana, it's a pretty cool place. It's crazy when you when you read about countries like Botswana, they have over a hundred thousand white people living there. You wouldn't have I mean, I wouldn't have expected somewhere around this region of the world to have one hundred thousand white people living there. Seems pretty weird. And I was reading up on uh, Anglo Indians and there's some really famous people, like singers especially and actors. They're actually genuinely Indian. But they're white. They're Anglo Indian. It's crazy, we're more reading uh, more about the world and such. It's pretty cool. There is currently not much going on in the world, which is why we're going so fast, but I am not opposed to that. I prefer it to go very fast. Now, that looks like David Gold. That definitely looks like David Gold. David Gold is the chairman for West Ham Football Club. That is David Gold. It's not Alian Ufamar Namur. That is David Gold. Right, extra construction factories. Could also be nice. Oh, yeah, we have the spare one, so we'll import some steel. Steel from somebody close. GB's technically our neighbour. Now. Oh. 
buy it from you, sure. What did I go for? Another construction effort, very good. I do need some actual construction stuff. Because I'll probably end up needing my other f uh, factories to go to the consumer goods eventually. And I am very opposed to the general idea. Civilian economy is ridiculous. We should not be civilian. So. Limited conscription. Oh, that's a pretty cool thing to go for, but. Military factory, construction speed, construction speed, dockyards, captain of industry, civilian uh, factory, construction speed, infrastructure. So we're talking charmant, no. Popular figurehead, no. Democratic reformer, no. I don't need better troops, we don't actually use troops. Okay, let's just go for the conscription. There you go, we've got an extra 30,000 men in our entire army. I'm now pretty interested in the population of Saudi Arabia, because that is hardly any people at all. I mean, 42. Damn. When you can so consider a million men from, like, North Africa and Arabian area, a million men in total moved to Germany, like, last year. That is a huge percentage of the people around here. They must have been on some breeding frenzy. Damn. And they're all claiming to come from here. Well, that's like half the population. <laughs> oh, man, that is... That's yeah, funny in the world. Support equipment, however, is acknowledged. Which means I want some engineers. Engineers, and we'll uh, build them some, some spades when I have more factories, I guess. When that time comes, they will be built. Spades. Very good. Now, what do these horses actually do? Not much, but they use less man power. Very good. Come on, fascism. Please don't say I have to do a civil war. Oh, maybe that's why you do the lesser people, because then the people ask the referendum, whereas this way you have civil war. I ooh. Yeah, now it's gone down. I don't like that. Why does it go down? Just stay at 0.10 every time. Why does it have to go down? Because it just, just drags so much. I can't be bothered with dragging. Which yes, we have an extra factory now. Which means I want... We'll have to go down this way to get the other civilians. So we'll go down the armament route. And we'll use our extra factories for extra stuff. But... Um... A coup can be executed. Very, very good. Now, the issue here is there is hardly any men of boots. Hardly any. There is, like, no one of boots at all. If there was a civil war, I do have the manpower and I do have some guns. But I don't have that much. In which case, if we do get an extra factor, what do you want guns? So that I can stockpile guns in the events that we have a civil war, I need to fight these men over here. See, Abu Dhabi, 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 why? Why do you have all this land, GB? Get out. Get out. Just get out. There's 42 people in all that space. How do they know it was only 42? I understand some places well, just nobody lives because it's pretty shit. Like, it's just deserts. It is just desert over here. And it's just desert over here as well, on the northern parts. Just deserts. Do we have sandstorms all the time? These guys don't, don't ever get a break. Pay respects to Saudi Arabia. They just never catch a break. It's just sand... That's all it is, it's just sand, look at it. A little bit of a hill, covered in sand. Where's the capital? There's a little factory. No, it just went straight past the capital, because you can't even see it, there's nothing there. <laughs> oh, look, really? Uh, no, there's nothing there, nothing. Baghdad, that's a city. Right, what do we want? We want this production efficiency cap. We want our factories actually be building stuff, not just being useless like they currently do. 
Very good. Come on. Lovely. I will be wanting more of that, please. Good sir. Please, may I have some more? Wait, what's this dot? See, at least they actually have a little port. It looks like there's somebody living there. You're just a mountain. Ludicrous. You guys, again, nothing. You have an airfield. Do we even have an airfield? Ah. We have nothing. Alright, oh, export. Eww, I want to get rid of that stuff. Army maneuver. Army defense. Ah, I do like defense. Logistics. Attrition down. Yes, please. Stop the attrition. Immediately. So that means we have two factories. Yes, we do. Very nice. Like some light tanks eventually as well. Once we have our four factory. And I want some artillery, but I seem to have forgotten to actually go after the artillery. Yes, yes, I did. I did indeed. It's uh, quite a shame. Are you guys aren't actually going to beat anyone? Yeah, let's just get rid of ya. Medina. Glory to Medina. Yes. It's easier to have a core in Cyprus. No, there are no cars in Cyprus. There needs to be more cores. I want to be able to paint the map. There's no forcible cores in France. Not even Vichy. Not even Brittany. I swear Brittany was in the game, though. I said it was just a modern timeline mod. That would make sense, actually. Right, RTYT, please. Yes, glorious. Then when you are done, we'll research the, uh, the other stuff for the factories. And... Yes. Um, and effort. If we ever get any experience, we'll be able to do some armaments. Very good. Yes, no template for my support equipment. But we don't actually build any. Why? You require this resource. Aluminium. Unfortunately, our factories go to consumer goods. So we lack the ability to save you there. I do apologize on their behalf. But, now do. Thank you for watching the first episode. Look forward to seeing you next time where we will attempt to turn fascist and cause all kinds of havoc in this January. I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye.